Good morning, America. The 200 plus years that we've been here in this country, we have been indoctrinated about the white Jesus. And we see the white Jesus as a divider, one who, well, sees that part of the population got something, the other part of the population doesn't. Uh, the white uh, Jesus that we have been indoctrinated with separates black from white. You can make white superior to all others and make white men superior to women and just treat the society that requires that if you're going to compete for life, you have to cheat, you got to steal, you got to be a racist, you got to be a bigot. All these things are going to come through with that white Jesus. But most recently, they indicated for some strange reason that that was fake. And I'm thanking God that it was fake. But they indicate that there's a black Jesus. And with the black Jesus, we know that all of that is fixed. You see, in the white Jesus, the way to life is competition. With the black Jesus, it's family. It's that one power that you can't see is responsible for every human being on earth, has prepared that every human being on earth have access to what they need to survive, equip them so they can participate in the process of life, and then allow them to choose a career that gave them their greatest joy. And they can engage themselves and just love living. And as they love living, they're creating life for every human being on earth. You're, we're all brothers and sisters. We suffer for nothing. Our needs, our wants, and our desires are met. That comes from the black Jesus. Now, in America, right now, it is, for it, it is as evil as it can be. <clears throat> the American population is seeking, trying its best to bring back the most evil man that has ever served as far as we know in the house in the white house as president of the united states but at the same time there's put before the american people a chance that you can switch away from that competition and bring in the family bring in the family where everybody benefits everybody not just some but everyone and so i say to you ladies and gentlemen why don't we try the black jesus because under this black jesus everybody is blessed Ain't no somebody superior. Ain't nobody competing. We even had the system set up so competing doesn't even work for you. Uh, trying to take advantage of somebody doesn't even work for you. It just destroys you and exposes you. So we know how to fix that stuff. So I'm saying, ladies and gentlemen, the white Jesus has failed us. Let's give the black Jesus a chance. All right? All right.